Mr. President, IDEO, together with the European Center for Democracy and Human Rights and Arabian Rights Watch Association, would like to direct the Council's attention to the Saudi-led coalition's war on Yemen that not only continues to indiscriminately kill and injure civilians, but has also impeded the exercise of the Yemeni people's right to self-determination by interfering with Yemen's political dialogue, with the use of troops and mercenaries from countries around the globe. The Saudi-led coalition was able to find a paid partner in Sudan, the president of which is wanted by the ICC for war crimes committed against the people in South Sudan. According to the ICC, Mr. Omar al-Bashir is allegedly criminally responsible for 10 counts under Article 25.3a of the Rome Statute. Since he has not been reined in, he was able to participate in the Saudi-led coalition with about 10,000 Sudanese troops to violate the Yemeni people's right to self-determination, as he allegedly did with the Sudanese people. The Saudi-led coalition hired mercenaries for what is alleged to be a private company connected to the founder of Blackwater. From December 1, 2015 to February 9, 2016, the Yemeni army and popular committees managed managed to kill and identify, in defense of their people, hundreds of Sudanese troops and foreign mercenaries with different nationalities near the Al-Umari military base in Ta'iz. These nationalities include Israeli, American, British, French, Italian, Ukrainian, Australian, Mexican, Colombian, Argentinian, Venezuelan, Chilean, Rwandan, and South African, to name a few. AQAP, which also has foreign mercenaries among its ranks, is widely known to operate and fight alongside the Saudi-led coalition in all southern provinces, including Hadramaut, Adan, Lahj, Abyan, al Shabwa, and Ta'iz. The Saudi-led coalition's war has impeded the, Yemenis, the Yemeni people's right to self-determination with the use of foreign troops, mercenaries, and globally designated terrorists, triggering the Yemeni people's right under the Vienna Declaration to take any legitimate action to end this war and to take all necessary and appropriate measures to ensure it never happens again. Mr. President, we call on the Council to ensure these perpetrators are punished by appropriate penalties, which take into account the grave nature of these offenses. Thank you. Thank you.